This is a mess. So uh, something a little different today as we're getting ready to uh, move some of our keepsakes from our house and into the trailer and then into the storage unit. Uh, we're getting a small storage unit, uh, the smallest unit that they can get uh, that's um, not climate controlled. Drove the trailer over from uh, Jake's house, one of my buddies, uh, the other day and I noticed that the wheel was kind of being all wonky and stuff but it, I just kept it under 60 miles an hour and it seemed like everything was okay. Anyway, I got to the house uh, and we went out last night and I looked at the trailer tire and this is what I found. Boom! Check out that spike. Pretty crazy, huh? Split like halfway down. You can see kind of halfway down there and just like blew itself up while parked in the driveway. Pretty nuts. So I'm out here um, in the Texas heat trying to change the tire. Not doing a good job though because it's uh, the tire places are closed so I guess we'll have to hit it up tomorrow. Oh well, get the tire off today. And of course as always, safety first. We got a couple jacks here. We got a we got a two ton jack right here. And then back there we got a 12 ton jack. Got a couple jack stands, one jack stands there. The other one is behind the back wheel over there. Come here. <laughs> There's my little helper. My little ammo, she got all decorated up. <laughs> she got she got her uh, makeup all on so that she could come help change a tire. I didn't tell her that she doesn't need makeup to help change a tire, but uh, she's doing a good job. You gonna help me? You gonna help me? Okay. Love you. <laughs> yep. Ah. Unconventional. You do it, put you back into it. You're normally supposed to leave the wheel on the ground before you start trying to take the tire off. But I forgot, and it's hard enough to get the jacks on there, the jack stands. So I'm doing it a little different and just using some, some force centrifugal force of the wheel going one way and me there we go and then me quickly turning the other way to uh, get the lug nuts off I waited at the stop sign got a hold of my head you want to spin it good job you can help me pull the tire off. Me? Keep going. Spin, spin, spin. Don't hit your face. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. Okay, Mandrel, come help me pull the tire off. Jesus, how do you do it? You just go ahead. Lift it off. How much does it weigh? Ammo, can you hold these? How much does it weigh? These are called lug nuts. How much is that weigh? Uh, maybe 40 pounds. That's what Celia weighs. Okay. I can barely. You ready? Oh! You're crazy. I mean, I know it, trailer tires aren't supposed to be sitting for a long time. Well, trailer tires are supposed to be sitting for a while, but um, the kind that we bought aren't supposed to be sitting for a long time because these are radial tires. So they're supposed to be used in driving, and this one had been sitting for like a year and a half or two years and only been used like twice. So that's probably just the fact that it was sitting for so long that See, it kind it's of pokey. blew up. Yeah, it's, it's so pokey. crazy that it did it after you parked. Yeah. It would have been really neat to catch it. <laughs> catch it in the action. Yeah. That would have been really fun to catch. Daddy, no. And see what it, how it happened. Yep. Or, okay. and if it was a huge... Okay, so you girls need to move back from the trailer. Watch out. Okay, and then we're going to drop the trailer down a little bit. So you're just making. to get the... 
We put makeup on because um, me and Emma like to play. And one way of playing is like this makeup thing, which is like she's a customer and I put makeup on her and then I do myself. And so we don't usually like putting lips on unless it's clear lips and then adding, unless it's clear lips. And we putting it a lot on, but if we have the eyeshadow chance to do it, we try to put clear lips on and then eyeshadow, but this time we just put eyeshadow on. That's why it looks not so like healthy, but it does look pretty. Then if you look at Ammo's, she we put the same color as hers on, so close your eyes. Put the same color for her lips on there. For her lips. And there's different colors. That yeah, we wear. have a lot of eyeshadow, two brush, two blushes, three brushes, and then and then we also have lips. There's like 14 of them. So, but we like all the lips are in different kind of colors. Some of them are glittery. Some of them are just lips. So, right? Yep. We are going to take one. Of these. What are those called? Mm. Lug nuts. Mom, you Lug nuts. That's a weird name for them. I'd call them screws, but okay. And then they, we have five of them, and they go into this. Let's go ahead and just screw them on. That's all, all we're trying to do is just trying to keep track of them so we don't lose them. Because if we do, we try not to touch the, the lug there. Dirty. Yeah. How dirty? I forgot what that thing's called. Center hub, that's what it's called. Okay, so we're just gonna keep screwing. That's good, that's good. Just to get them on there so we don't lose them. Okay. Because we gotta put the wheel back on tomorrow. Where are so, we gonna get a new wheel from? We have this cousin named Celia, and her parents are named Rena and Erwin, and they live right kind of real close to the place for tires, so yeah. They're gonna help us. Right there? Mm -hmm. Yep. Turn it around. Other way. Look, this way. Okay, baby, oh, that's good. Okay, right here. Okay, twist on there. There you go. Why didn't you get the Great job. These kids always thinking about food. Because we're food monsters. Okay, all done. Bye, peace out.